Welcome back. My name is David Bombal, CCIE 11023. In this video we're going to look at VPIM networking. VPIM or Voice Profile for Internet Mail allows us to exchange voice messages between various messaging systems. The first thing to take note of, and I find that this is one of the things that causes confusion, is we are not talking about PBXs or Cisco Unified Communications Managers, or CUCMs, or Cisco Unified Communications Manager Express. We are not talking about telephone systems. In this video we are discussing voice messaging systems such as Unity Express, Unity Connection, and Cisco Unity exchanging voice messages. VPIM is an open standard and thus voice messages can be transmitted between different voicemail systems as it supports multimedia messaging using MIME for email. This is the crux of the matter. We are allowing voice messaging systems to exchange voicemail in a very similar way to email systems. VPIM uses SMTP for mail exchange in the same way as standard email. It uses MIME and other extensions to carry information such as the voicemail as well as the recorded name and the v-card and I'll explain more of that in a moment but firstly please make sure that you understand that in this video we are not discussing telephone systems making calls to other telephone systems so rather than me calling your phone and leaving a voicemail for you I dial into my local voicemail and then my voicemail system emails a voicemail to your voicemail system. So we're not calling each other. I'm dialing into my local voicemail which is emailing a voicemail to you. So in this picture I've got some examples of Cisco Unity Express which runs on AIMS or network modules and so forth as well as Cisco Unity or Unity Connection running on a server. Once again we are not discussing PBXs or making calls between phone systems, this is the emailing of voicemail between voice messaging systems. Now before getting into the details of VPIM and how messages are exchanged between the messaging systems, I want to remind you how we can send messages between telephones connected to for instance Cisco Unity Express or Cisco Unity Connection. So in this example I've got a router running Cisco Unified Communications Manager Express with Cisco Unity Express and I've got some telephones. So let me remind you once again how to send voicemails between telephones. So I'm not calling from one phone to another, I'm sending a voicemail from one phone to another. So in this example I'm going to dial into the voicemail with telephone 1001 and then I'm going to send a voicemail to telephone 1000. So notice I'm not going to call 1000 from 1001 but I'm going to send a voicemail to that phone. So on the left hand side we have telephone 1001 and on the right hand side we have telephone 1000. So I'm going to go off hook on 1001 and press the messages button. Enter your password followed by hash. Put the password in or PIN. Of New York. Hello, you have no new messages. To send a message, press 2. You have no old messages. For setup options, press 4. For help, press 0. To exit, press star. So I'm going to press 2 to send a voicemail. Spell the name of the recipient. Spell the last and first name, then press hash. For Q, press 7. For Z, press 9. For help, press 0. To switch between spelling and number entry, press hash hash. Now in this example I'm going to press pound pound or hash hash. Enter the extension followed by hash. For help press zero. To switch between spelling and number entry press hash hash. So I'm using number rather than name. So I'm going to put in the extension of 1000. Four. Sarah London. At extension one zero 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 press hash. For a new search press star. Added. To add another name, press 1. For message options, 3. Record the message, hash. Cancel message, star. 
So I'm going to press hash or pound. Record your message at the tone. When you are finished, press hash. Hi Sarah, this is a test message from Bob at extension 1001. Hopefully you'll get this message. Bye. Thank you. For message options, press 1. To send the message, press hash. I press pound. Message sent. To send another message, press 1. To exit, press star. You have no new messages. To send a message, press 2. You have no now. old messages. So we now have a message waiting indicator on line 1 on this telephone. So 1000 has now got an indication of a voicemail. So we can go off hook, press the messages button. Enter your password, followed by hash. Sarah London. Hello, you have one new message. To play new messages, press 1. I'm to press send a one. message, press new messages. Bob, New York. At extension 1001 sent message. 1 today at 2.20 p.m. Hi Sarah, this is a test message from Bob at extension 1001. Hopefully you'll get this message. Bye. To repeat this message, press 1. To save it, press 2. To delete it, press 3. Deleted. End of new messages. So we were able to send a voicemail from 1001 to 1000 by dialing into Unity Express and using the option 2 to send the voicemail. So rather than 1001 phoning 1000 directly, 1001 pressed the messages button, dialed into Unity Express, pressed 2 to send a voicemail, recorded the voicemail, the voicemail was accepted, message waiting indication was set on 1000, 1000 then dialed in and was able to retrieve the voicemail. Now let's send a voicemail from 1000 to 1001, but rather than using hash hash or pound pound, to select the recipient based on number, let's search based on name. So I'll go off hook, press the messages button. Enter your password, followed by hash. Sarah London. Hello, you have no new messages. To send a message, press 2. You have no old messages. So I'm going to press 2 option. to send a message. Spell the name of the recipient. Spell the last and first name, then press hash. For Q, press 7. For Z, press 9. For help, press 0. So I'm going to press B. 4. Of New York. At extension 1001. Zero, zero, one. Press hash. Press added. To add another name, press 1. For message options, 3. Record the message, hash. I'm going to Cancel press hash. Message, star. Record your message at the tone. When you are finished, press hash. Hi Bob, this is a message from Sarah London at extension 1000. Hopefully you'll get this message. Bye. Thank you. For message options, press 1. To send the message, press hash. Press pound. Message sent. To send another Notice message, Notice the message press was received. To exit, I'm going to end the call. Now the reason I pressed B for the username was because that's how the user was configured on Unity Express. So I'll log in as my administrator and notice on configure users you can see that there's a user here BNY which is actually Bob New York. Notice the surname was set up as BNY. So I'll change the first name to Bob and the surname to New York and click apply. And now on my phone, just to prove this to you, I'm going to change the skin to the default skin. I'm going to press the messages button. Enter your password followed by hash.